This week's episode proudly brought to you by West Motor Company. On this week's episode of the Auto Collection Series, we take a look at what makes West Motor Company different from all the other dealers and why you should buy your next car from them. Preston, Idaho is home to one of the best car dealerships in the country. Sitting on the edge of town is West Motor Company, a dealership that is more than just a place to buy cars. Okay, I'm Doug Porter. I've been here at West Motor my most of my life. I started here in 1980. I uh, worked here when I was in high school. So at 16, I started working here and bought my first car at 16. My mom told me I couldn't have a car until I could pay for my own, and that wasn't the right thing because I figured out a way to do it. Hi, I'm Doug West, a former owner of West Motor. I work with Doug and Mike and the crew here now. Been here for 52 years. Our family, my father started the business back in 1945. Uh, my oldest sibling, my sister Sydney, uh, worked at the dealership detailing cars back in the day. My, my brother George and my brother Ralph uh, I'll work through the dealership, every department as, as I did, and, and Doug Porter also. I'm Dave Porter. I'm one of the owners here at West Motor Ford. I've been here just a few months, but I, I grew up in the car business. Worked at West Motor as a kid, and pretty much been in the car business my whole life. And, and even when I haven't been in the car business, I've been looking at auctions online and just Always, always looking at cars, dreaming about cars, driving cars, talking about cars. It's, it's pretty much been my number one hobby my whole life. I'm Mike Porter with West Motor. I've been here for about 15 years. Um, as a kid, my dad owned the dealership and I had a chance to hang out here and get to know everybody and a lot of the guys that I got to know when I was in high school are still here. Uh, my name is Rick Durant. Uh, I worked here at West Motor Company for about 33 years. They hired, hired me on as a parts manager. Most recently, uh, five or six years ago, I became the parts and service director of the Dodge store. And then when they purchased the Ford store about uh, a year ago, I became parts and service director at the Ford store as well. I'm Jason Sharp. I've been here at West Motor for about 27 and a half years now. I currently managing West Motors Body Shop. Hey, I'm Lynn McKay, uh, service manager here at West Motor. Been here for about 21 years now. Uh, my name is Jeff Acock. I've been a technician for the Ford dealer here in Preston since 1986. Uh, mechanical repair has always been in my blood. I restored uh, a couple old cars before I even started. 
My name is Jay Kirkbride. I've been here for 29 years consecutively and uh, 33 years in total. Um, I'm the sales manager here at West Motor and been loving working here because of the great uh, atmosphere that we have. Got a great staff. And, you know, I started here when I was 15 years old, and the day that I started, uh, Doug West and Doug Porter, the, the current owners at that time, told me that the most important thing that we did uh, was take care of the customer. And that's exactly what West Motor Company has been doing since, looking after the customers and the community. But well, we've enjoyed uh, being here in the same location for since 1945. Uh, a little bit of history. My father started uh, in Logan, Utah, in the corner of Fourth North and Main before World War II, and uh, they sold uh, Hudsons and, and had a flying a gas station with uh, Vern Cook, who used to have uh, Cook Transportation in Logan. They were partners in, until uh, World War II, and then my father came to. Uh, Preston and opened the, reopened the airport. He had a, a partner, motor, his name was Bruce Wallace. And in 1950, my father uh, bought Bruce out and it's been West Motor ever since. I started working here in 1980, Doug and I, Doug West, whose father started the business back in 1945. And it was called Wallace and West back then, and then it just became West Motor. And Doug and I worked here through high school together for his dad and his brother. And then I left for a while after I graduated from high school, and I worked with my dad, and he stayed here and worked with his brother. And then one day he called me up and said, "My brother's leaving, and do you want to come back and be partners with me?" So I said, "Sure, I love cars." So I came back in 1980, and uh, been here ever since just having fun with buying and selling cars and helping people find a car for them. And I mean, that's the second biggest expense that people have in their life and everybody loves the freedom of car. So I decided that I liked cars and I was enrolled in the auto tech program at Preston High School. And uh, we uh, fixed cars over there. I had. In my sophomore year, we took it for an hour, but my junior and senior year, we took it for three hours. So I've been involved with auto mechanics my whole life. And so then I started working here as a, a lot boy. And we pumped gas in that back in those days and in the 70s. And we've changed tires and washed cars and, and uh, cleaned the lots and washed the shop and did those kind of things. Uh, eventually they, they had an old sewing machine in the back that uh, I learned how to do upholstery. So we would do upholstery and detail cars. And so my first car, I did a little upholstery on it. I took the automatic transmission out of it and put in a manual transmission. And it was a little car. And uh, I decided that I liked to go fast. We liked to race cars. We raced horses and bicycles and motorbikes. So when I got into the car business, I started doing cars and I fixed that little car up and uh, got it to the point where it would actually pop a wheelie. The thing I enjoy most about working for West Motor is, uh, I would say it, it, it's the atmosphere. Uh, we have a good group of men and ladies here that their number one goal and desire is to put out a good product for our customer. We want the customer to be able to come in and to get anything transportation-wise they want for their vehicle, whether it be accessories or, or repairs. And we have a, a group of people that are just phenomenal in wanting to do their best so that we can provide that service for the customers and that's what brings the customers back. And that's the most important thing that, uh, that, that our staff here at West Motor does is take care of the customer. Do what we can to take care of our customers and make people happy. We're all trying to help the customer at the end of the day and, and, uh, and take care of each other and, and it's just a really fun environment to be, to be in. We have a really good staff that treats people fairly and 
we don't believe in the high pressure and the trickery that you can find at other places. We, we're just here to help people and to make it easy and simple and straightforward and to be as fair and honest as we possibly can be. Customer relations. It's not a business just about getting people in, uh, people in to get their cars fixed and stuff. We want a relationship with our customers. That's what I think is important. And that's what they feel, I think. I love to work with people. It's probably my favorite thing is just to see customers here and happy and uh, have the opportunity to help them with their vehicles, help them buy a vehicle, fix a vehicle. Um, one thing that I think makes us really unique is uh, our sales process is very different than most dealerships. When you come here, you work with one person. Uh, they're not going back and forth, checking with the manager to see if they can do that or that, or we're not gonna throw your trade-in keys on the roof so you can't leave. Very, very laid back, relaxed atmosphere. You're gonna be talking to probably someone that you know, that you've known for a long time. And we treat customers as real people and, and as friends because that's what they are, as our friends. and. Uh, we don't want them to leave here thinking, oh man, I can't believe I just did that, or did I make the right decision? It's a no pressure situation so that every person that comes here, they make the decision what they want to do. If they like the car or the truck and they want to buy it, that's great. We're going to help that happen. If they want a couple of days to think about it, that's totally fine too. They're not going to feel any pressure from any of our sales guys. And again, like I said, there's not going to be any running back and forth to the manager. And, well, they offered this, can we do it? Da -da -da. We just don't do that. You'll be able to deal with one person the whole time through the whole process. They teach us the importance of taking care of our customers. We're not all here just fixing cars every day. We're here taking care of customers. And that's, when people come here to the body shop, they come because they've had a bad day. They don't come here usually because they're wanting to. They've got a problem and we're here to take care of their problems. Whether it be restoring old trucks to building muscle cars for their customers, West Motor also plays a big part in this small community. It is a sponsor of a lot of community events that are held in this town, from parades, rodeos, and numerous other motoring events. It's important to give back because the community's given us so much over the years that it's, uh, I feel it's really important to, that we give back and we do our best to help out as much as we can with those kind of things. We have good people here now, a lot of them have been here a long time, great salespeople and people who care about the customer and that's what, that's what matters, is, is taking care of the customer and, and making them feel like they've got good value honest deal and, and nobody pressuring them to the point where they're mad when they're done. It's a fun job when we can see the people's faces. After an accident, they're so distraught and they come to pick up something and it's amazing that it's in the good of shape or better than when they wrecked it. And we appreciate everybody out there for the support that they've given us over the years and we look forward to many more and we promise to keep up with technology and everything we can to fix those high-tech cars that are coming out today. We've assembled a great team that uh, is, is dedicated to doing that. Uh, honestly, I have a pretty easy job because the team that, 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 that we've put together, uh, they have a desire to take care of the customer. They have a desire to to make sure that they're happy with their purchase, with their buying experience, with their ownership experience. From a personal note, just like to thank all of those who work here with me at West Motor for the things that they do and their willingness to go the extra mile to help take care of our customers. Uh, we want uh, longevity out of our employees. And and if you keep your employees happy, then they're going to do a good job so that we can provide better for our customers and we want customers for life. And so no matter who you deal with at West Motor, um, they are going to do their best to provide you the best buying ownership experience possible. You know, it's been a great place to work. Uh, 
Doug and Mike and the rest of the team here, all the guys in the shop and the dealership, good people to work with, uh, it's a good attitude. It's just a, it's a fun place to be. We're going to carry on and, and have five-star service. We, we, we got five-star individuals to come work with us. We've had uh, so many great people. I want to thank them all. Wouldn't be here today without uh, the staff and the people that have worked with us over the years. We've had a fantastic group of people that uh, I love them dearly. We appreciate all the customers that we have and all the ones that we may get down the road and we've been taking care of some families for generations. Uh, I remember dealing with their parents and their parents are long gone and the, the family's still buying cars and still coming here and just appreciate all of our customers and we hope that we can earn your business and keep it. We just, we just love being here. Now, as seen earlier, West Motors also sells dog food. Mike Porter explains why. The dog food thing kind of started as, as a joke. Everybody made fun of me. Um, I have dogs that love to hunt birds. I actually uh, go down to Paradise, Utah, and I guide different uh, bird hunts. So I've got a bunch of uh, German wire hair dogs. And one of our customers approached me one day and was talking about dog food with somebody and I kind of overheard him and so I got talking to him and I tried the dog food and I was really impressed with it. So we decided that uh, we would start selling it and uh, everybody laughed at me. They said, why are you going to sell dog food at a car dealership? And I said, why not? It's a really good product and I like it and it makes it easier for me too. So we started selling dog food and they have us on the internet that we have this dog food when people are looking for this type of dog food. and. Uh, Everybody quit laughing at me one day when someone came up here to buy dog food and while they were here they got looking at trucks and came back the next day or a couple days later and bought a new truck. So now they don't make fun of me for the dog food anymore. <laughs> As you have heard and seen, the West Motor Company truly prides itself on its team and reputation. Selling and maintaining cars is more than just for the purpose of winning awards, to which West Motors has won plenty over the years, including some prestigious ones. The people at West Motor Company are extremely passionate about what they do and really think about the customer first. And if you would like to see the full length of this video, stay tuned and visit www.i10.tv. Till next time, I'm Sam Scholl and thanks for watching the Auto Collection Series. These episodes are proudly brought to you by West Motor Company. For all your Ram, Chrysler, Dodge, Jeep, and Ford needs, new or used, they've got them.